So today we're going to be, um, uh, I guess I'm going to be reviewing the uh, Ren and Stimpy reboot that came out uh, recently. Well, I mean, it's how, that's all that matters. But um, so I know there's some very stupid people who would argue, oh, this isn't the first time Ren and Stimpy's been rebooted. Oh, this isn't the first show that's like Ren and Stimpy. Tell me, what does this remind you of? <laughs> What does this remind you of? What does this remind you of? You are obsessed with this. Hey, you're the one showing me off. And now you see, Cat Dog is absolutely nothing like Ren Stimpy because, unlike Cat Dog, Ren Stimpy is actually good. <laughs> um. Okay, so this is where I would like normally like include footage from the reboot, but um. Because Viacom is such a fucking worthless asshole company, I have to, uh... I'm just gonna show footage of, like, cats acting drunk, I guess. Uh, so, um... Uh, the reboot was, uh... Kind of humorous at times, uh... Uh, there was a scene where, um... Uh, Ryan got sent to hell, um... Oh, that was pretty funny, um... And there was a scene where, uh, where the devil said bitch, um, that, that was pretty funny, um, and there was a scene where Ren got hurt, um, that was pretty funny, um, and there was this, and then they went to a house, a really bad looking house, a really shitty looking house, um, that was pretty funny, um, Uh, yeah, it was pretty funny overall. Uh, I give it a, a 5 out of 10. Yeah, yeah, it was pretty good. Uh, like and subscribe and I'll review Underground Ernie next. The screwball in the back pocket. <laughs>